What's going on guys? Jackson here from Vendetta Sports Media and today we are playing a brand new game. This just released early access on Steam called Rising Front. This is a very artistic uh, depiction, World War I uh, trench warfare simulator, uh, extremely early access. There's uh, a huge roadmap that the developer, I think it's just one guy. Um, where I saw a lot of this from originally was from on TikTok, and so obviously being the history nut and having history degree guy like I am, I definitely wanted to see about this game. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to check this out. We're going to look at some scenarios here. I did do a little bit of just the sandbox play just to kind of get an idea, but let's see. Attack of the Dead Men. Defend the Russian fort for as long as possible. Attack the town and take the enemy HQ. Attack and defend the trenches. Battle of the trenches. Farmhouse. All right, let's just do this battle of the trenches first. Join the Discord. That may be something that I do. Just load out. So we can change our loadout here. So, hmm. so it looks like we could have anything. Uh, I think we're just going to stick with the Gurren 98. Yes. Oh, we could go with the Lewis gun. That would be interesting. Um, I say we just stick with this knife and the bandage as well in case things get hairy. Uh, we can let's carry a bit more rifle ammo, less pistol ammo, uh, four grenades and three bandages. Sure. Why not? Okay. All right. It faced us the wrong way. That's fine. So do we need to defend our positions first? Got lots of dudes with some automatic, early automatic weapons and then everything. Oh man, I like the aesthetics. There needs to be more World War I games out there. There should 100% be more World War I games out there. More World War I movies as well. You kidding me? There we go. There goes another. The sound is very pleasing of this game. Oh! Oh, that guy. Something weird happened to him. I thought he got... I thought he just bit the dust. Got another guy. I'm trying to... Hit. looks like an officer. Oh, my gosh. Missed him. Oh, I got hit. Nope, those are the grenades. There we go. Patch ourselves up. Is that a guy? I can't tell. I don't think it is. I think it's just like a stump. So reload. So yeah, like I said, you know, it's very... The animations are a little weird. But so far... It's not a terrible game, especially for if it's one dude that worked on this game. This is very impressive for one person. Hello? Fellow fighter of the First World War. Oh, come on now. There we go. Oh, there's a little dink noise for headshots. That's good. Good feedback. Oh, here we go. We're going over the top. We're going over the top, boys! <laughs> All right, this is cool. This is cool. This is cool. Got a little house right here. Let's get in it. Yeah, that's right. Sit down. Watch out, bro. Yeah, that tree's protecting him. Okay, we're in a prone, or yeah, we're prone. We got another one. We got two more shots left. Go! Push, push, push. There's another headshot. Let's go ahead. We're going to reload. Ah, it's not toggle. Okay. Frag out. Frag out! Oh, oh! Bad frag! Bad frag! Bad frag! Oh my gosh. This is- Oh! 
This is getting insane. Gonna patch myself up. We're running in with a pistol! Oh! oh, we're dead. Oh, we got shredded by a machine gun. Oh, man, we did not. Man, look at all the Lewis guns up here, bro. This is insane. Can we... Oh, I have to... I have to manually redeploy. Gotcha. Further on down the line, in the development cycle, like, I, I'm always going to support indie projects. Especially one like this. This is, this is an indie project that I could get behind very nicely. Oh my gosh, the just, the, oh my gosh. Man's missing his leg. This is insane. Oh my gosh, just the, the carnage. Machine gunners as best as we can. Oh, oh, hey, hey, hey. Oh my gosh, here they come. Oh, there's just, there's nothing I can do. Oh no. Headshot. Picking them apart. Yeah, boy. Okay, we're starting over with the Battle of the Trenches because there is a build menu here. I'm sorry, what? What is, like, what is this? Where am I? Oh, this is still here. Oh. I can place this wherever I want. Whoa, this this kind of changes the game. I'm not going to lie. Oh my gosh. Oh. oh my gosh. Okay, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to build up. I'm going to build up our trench. Oh my gosh. This is so okay. This makes a ton more sense now. One hour later. Command map. What? 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 Hold up. Oh my gosh. You can command troops. I never, I never knew that. You know, if there was a tutorial, that might have been nice to know. It probably would have been a good idea to play that. <laughs> okay, now we've got a bit of a grasp on what's happening. All right, now let's uh, let's kill some Brits. Shot him in the leg. I'm pretty sure. Let's find a bunker to get into. Let me in. Oh, that's not. Oh my gosh, this is insane. So this shows about where the reinforcements are. Okay, that's insane. That's insane. We know now. Let's see. Command map. Let's get a German rifle platoon. I'm going to hold that spot. Execute order. Okay, here come reinforcements. Yep, and here they go. Let's see. Deployable. We're going to concentrate right there. And then... Seems to be a large concentration of troops here as well. Going to execute the orders there. Alright, you guys. we got to fill up... We're going to fill up these second trenches. There we go. Let's take a peek at what's happening out here. Need already to soften these guys up. Is the artillery softening them up? That's the question. Is the artillery softening them up? Let's see. Command map. 
if it wasn't for me, didn't I buy a machine? All right, we're going to send another wave up here. Execute that order. More artillery strikes here in the left. Concentrating on the left. Come on, come on. Need that already to soften them up. Oh my gosh, these grenades. We're in the wire. We're in the wire. In the wire. Come on, push. I got I to gotta bandage up. We're in the wire. We're in the wire. Come on. Ah, oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, I died. I died. I died. Let me spawn back. Let me spawn back. Come on now. All right, hopefully we can save up a little bit, get some, uh, come on, you can't be, you can't be dying in the trench. Die on the field, not the trench. Now's the time, let's push, let's push, let's push. Start getting some reinforcements back here. See if we can't cut off some of the reinforcements. All right, and we'll save the rest until it's time to try and make a push. Come on! Push, 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 push. Oh, wow. Tab just takes me right here. That's excellent. We've made it to their trench. Oh, this is fantastic. I'm so happy I figured that out. All right, we're going to hold their trench. We're going to hold their trench. We're gonna hold their trench. All right, what do we do here? Here we go, we got some more artillery coming down. Try to soften up this, uh, this assault. And then we'll make the push for their HQ. Okay, this is, th this game is a lot of fun. I'm going to come out and say it right now. It's like 13 bucks on Steam right now. It, <laughs> go get this game, man. This is this is crazy. All right, we're surviving the onslaught for now. I'm just going to try to let some of my uh let some of my money's come back up. All right, here we go. Final push. Oh my gosh. There's so many dudes. Insane. All right, let's see. Can we bring in some more artillery barrages? Indeed, we can. Right there. And right. Here. That's the heaviest concentration, I think. Artie's walking us up. We are in their camp. Did we do it? I think we done did it. The German flag now flies proudly over this camp. Is it friendly fire? They're 100% is friendly fire. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what an unfortunate way to figure that out. But wow, that was in oh. How do I how do I go up? Oh, okay. That's a bit of a, some weird controls, but wow. What an amazing what an amazing time that was. I don't know where these guys are running off to, but that was just incredible. That's so cool. I cannot wait to see 
what more this game has in store. I can't wait to look at the other maps that are in this game, some of the other scenarios. It looked like you can create your own scenarios as well. I gotta tell you guys, for an indie game, this 100% was worth my time, and I think it would be worth your time. If you're a big World War One history buff, uh, then or just like a history buff in general, this 100% is going to be the game for you guys. But that's going to do it for me here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, this little video on Rising Front, definitely, like I said again, going to have to play some more of this game. Uh, can't wait to see what the developer has. Uh, for the future, uh, I'll put a link down in the Steam page to the descript in the description so you can take a look at it as well uh, as the roadmap for this game. But anyway, again, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did enjoy the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you do subscribe to the channel, then hit the notification bell so you can be notified the next time a new video drops. This is Jackson Law for Vendetta Sports Media, signing off, and I will see you guys next time. Oh,